So the second episode shows in space where Ego's ship has crash landed in New York, which is 1988, where we see a young Peter Quill coming out of it. And the reason that he actually has his powers is because in the first Guardians of the Galaxy movie, we see Yondu and the Ravishers kidnap Quill and raise him as his own. But that doesn't actually happen in What If universe, because in this one, Yondu didn't have a change of heart because he's still a cold-hearted mercenary who takes him to his father, Ego, who took away his Walkman and make him use his powers, which of course, using the seedlings to actually conquer the world. Just like in the second Guardians of the Galaxy movie, which it actually happens, where S.H.I.E.L.D. have actually noticed the attack, and which caused Patty Carter and Howard Stark to actually mobilize the Avengers, which of course happens to be Hank Pym, Ant-Man, who's trying to take care of his daughter Hope after Janet disappearance, then also bring in T'Chaka, aka Black Panther, which we see how he makes his return, which is Connie and Bill Foster, who played by Lawrence Fisher, who's in the Ant-Man and the Wasp movie, and also bringing in Bucky, the Winter Soldier, where we knew that he could be betraying them, in which we could tell how he is actually getting ready to actually join the group, but still under the mind control of Hydra, in which they spotted Peter, where Foster actually dubbed the giant man suit, which the same power that gave Ant-Man that ability, in which, of course, Hank still has the shrink tech, in which we see how Peter, enjoying himself in the carnival, where we knew how they're trying to apprehend him, but he using his powers to bring them all down with Wendy Larson, also known as Marvell, actually helping them, by which Thor appears and actually stop Peter. But they realize that the seedling have actually used to conquer all of Asgard and the other realms. But we knew how Hope realized that Peter isn't a bad guy. E Ego is. So she freed him by using the tech that Hank gave him, which is the smartest thing to do, but it's a, also a good thing to give Peter closure when he visits his mother's grave. So now they actually realize where Peter is, but we can tell how Ego is actually getting ready to hunt down Peter and finish what he has started. So now he is actually getting ready to actually destroy the earth. But he visits his mother's graveside and actually saw Hank trying to convince him. When Bucky tries to kill Peter, 
Howard actually intercepted the comm link between him and the Hydra agents, so we knew how they are trying to get to Peter, knowing of how they've successfully did. And they got the seedling, which they come from the ego, where we knew that he won't let him destroy the earth. So he goes Dragon Ball Z all over Ego and defeated him. In which everyone ce celebrate the victory, which of course, seeing me see Bucky actually went out on his own terms, knowing that he sticks to the shadows, knowing that the fact that earlier Howard mentions Steve's name, but of course he knew that it. Captain America wouldn't want his friend to kill people. So now we see how he decided to leave. But they still have their mission still ahead when they actually knew that Yigo is in his planet. So now they're actually go to his planet form as they finally been assembled. So we knew how Peter in the alternate universe have gotten his powers awakened from his father Ego, who played by Russell Crowe, which means that he has the other Avengers, not like the new ones, but the old school Avengers have stopped him, which there's actually the plot twist of how the first Guardians of the Galaxy movie shows how Yondo raised him, but he didn't. He turned him over to Ego, where in the second one, they used the seedling plot to actually fighting over it. So we're going to see what's going to happen on the next episode tomorrow. So anyway, like this video, subscribe for more, and comment what you think about the episode. You guys can also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr, and my Facebook page and Twitch. Until then, this is Anime Guy here saying signing out. Laters and be safe.